hi everyone welcome back to my channel if you're new here hey my name is jessica i am wearing the outfit already um i'm pretty late to this whole winter looks type of video but i figured this is the prime where it gets really cold so we might as well just do it now to kind of start giving you guys inspiration of you know new ways to look warm and stylish especially like for the outside we're not talking about indoor cozy wear we're talking about to stay warm if you're walking around outside so yeah i'm gonna show you unique ways to stay warm and different looks for the winter let's start with this look love it so i am wearing my balaclava i got this from target i'm sure it's still available i love it it has like a simple white line this is perfect to stay warm if you don't want to wear a scarf this is just the perfect look if you don't want the hat you can also put it down it can kind of also work as a scarf or a neck warmer whatever you want to call it so this is sweater that i got from i believe it was kmart a long time ago or sears one of those that doesn't exist anymore it says dress cool i forgot this even existed i found it in my closet like all the way in the back so i wanted to add that i am wearing this pleated skirt got during the summertime and it has shorts so it's perfect i'm not going to review anything and i also am wearing these tights that are plaid got it from target and i'm wearing these crew socks to wear with these loafers for a very preppy look and this purse is thrifted and this camel coat is thrifted hi so i am going to continue on with the next outfit this is it close up of it is basically a beanie that i got from my job last year it has like the zebra pattern to it it reminds me of the beach house album if you know you know and i am wearing this super bright green kelly green type of a sweatshirt i got from michael's oversized of course so it's super cozy so for the rest of the outfit i am wearing leather straight leg drawstring pants this is perfect for the winter because you can layer underneath it like a thermal legging of some sort so you can stay super cozy and warm and then i'm wearing these cowboy boots with them inside to keep my toes warm and i am wearing this long sherpa fleece uh, jacket that i got from h&m and this patent leather cross uh, body type of purse that i got from asos So this is the next outfit by the way i'm so sorry if you hear background noises of hammering and the frame did change so my apologies on that i am trying so i am wearing a black turtleneck black turtlenecks go with literally everything as a learning piece it's such a central thing to have in your closet in my opinion i am wearing this uh sweater vest that i got from poshmark I love it because it adds like a little texture to the outfit. It has like blues and navies and blacks and little hints of gray. It's super cute. And I am wearing these wool dress pants. These are amazing. I'm just going to tell you guys, this is the secret that a lot of people don't know. Wool dress pants are such a good thing to wear in the winter time, especially if they're wide leg like this because you have room to put some tights or leggings underneath it to stay super warm and uh, I love wearing these pants casually so that's why I decided to pair them with these beige out white sneakers that I wear all the time year round because they're pleather your feet are gonna be warm we're gonna keep it monotone with this gray aviator um, like like faux fur line look how beautiful this is super cute I got this in the south section from H&M last year I'm sure they have something like this this year. I will definitely link it down below, anything similar to it. But yeah, super cute. Okay, so this is the next outfit. Super simple. I'm wearing this cable knit sweater that I thrifted recently. 
because it's 100 percent cotton i'm not claustrophobic and like hot and sweaty with it but i'm so cozy i'm wearing these just regular leggings i think that's from h&m don't remember and i got these white cream socks to go to peek out from the docks to add a little something a little dimension to the outfit and to add a little bit of color i'm gonna add this beanie that's a forest green color that i thrifted as well and then i'm gonna add an extra layering piece that i'm super excited to show you guys this long leather trench that my dad got me he has it in his closet and he never wears it so he just told me i can keep it and i'm obsessed look how good this is oh my god it's so good and i'm gonna put this bag so to add a little bit more texture to the outfit and yeah simple outfit So this is the next outfit, super simple. I am wearing a set that I got from Blue and Gray. Super cozy and warm and soft. I think it's a very easy outfit for the winter time if you don't want to try hard. Uh, outfit that's matching the top and the pant, super easy. And if you want it to look a little bit more dressier, I will add like a short jacket or something structured to it so it doesn't look like such a sweatsuit. I uh, got this jacket that i absolutely love that has a bunch of lint to it i'm so sorry it has left a lot into it but i love like that is black and it has like little uh white stitching all around it to make it a little different and it goes perfect with the docks so there you go and to add layer to it so this is it with the black wool jacket underneath it i like how it has a little peak of a white stitching a little hint of menswear inspired in there and to add this infinity scarf to keep me super warm there you go so you do look dressy but it doesn't look like you tried really hard all right so this is the next outfit i am wearing this gray turtleneck like i said it's essential to add a little texture to it i added this pleather jacket that i got from zara and i have this beanie that i thrifted recently that goes perfect with this fluffy jacket perfect look look how similar it is in color i am wearing these straight leg jeans they have a rip on it but you can definitely wear tights with it if you're outside if you don't want your knees to freeze and then my cowboy boots my trusty leather cowboy boots it just ties it all together all right the next outfit is similar to the last one in a way because we are adding turtleneck underneath it so it can add that extra layer, extra texture, extra color to the outfit. So I have this striped turtleneck. And then I'm wearing my straight leg jeans that I thrifted from Lee. And then I'm wearing my favorite uh, square toed ankle boots I got from ASOS. I'm going to add this fluffy bucket hat that I got from H&M. Super cute. We are going to add this fluffy zip-on fleece uh, little jacket this is from Uniqlo they have this literally every year I think right now they're like at $20 well at least the last time I bought it for um, Black Friday this is such a good layering piece if you're always toasty or warm you wear this this is so elite and it's such a simple layering piece because it adds a little texture because it's very fuzzy and warm so this is the outfit with that extra layering piece you can still see the turtleneck underneath it there it is and then because it's fluffy with fluffy it kind of goes well together and then we're gonna add this puffer jacket I mostly thrifted this is from case setter don't know where it's from but 
it looks very vintage so yeah this is the outfit super cute cozy and warm add a little bit more texture to it because i have this puffer jacket i want to add this like puffer bag that i got from poshmark to add a little bit more theme to the outfit i think it's super cute ready to go i am wearing the same pants with the blue like the last outfit but definitely different because i'm wearing balaclava and this sweatshirt and my thrifted camel jacket obsessed with this look i think i look like i'm ready to go skiing or something i got these glasses from Rushmore rack by the way i'm really into like the square oversized frames right now but yeah this is the outfit and if you are not that cold you could definitely fold down the balaclava and use it kind of like an infinity scarf for like a little pop of color or texture to the outfit so kind of like this in a way you just do this take your hair out and yeah you have like kind of like infinity scarf in a way or like a added protecting layer if you don't want your head to be covered completely This is the outfit that I came up with. I am wearing my straight leg jeans and a dark wash with no rips on it this time. I am wearing my square toed ankle boots because it gives me a little height. I am also wearing a t-shirt underneath this quarter zip sweater. This quarter zip sweater is so adorable. It has like little sheeps on it. And I am wearing this bomber jacket that my dad gave me. Obsessed with this jacket collection, guys. There's a lot of jackets that he doesn't wear and he just gave it to me. Love that. I'm obsessed with all his jackets. Um, so I took this one and I am wearing this green beanie that I thrifted again. I think it adds a really nice hint of color to the outfit because I do wear a lot of neutrals. So yeah, this is the outfit. So this is the next outfit. I am wearing the same straight leg jeans, but I decided to wear them with my black loafers that I got from ASOS. I am wearing black socks underneath it, but um, I do like wearing really long pants with loafers, so you can't tell they're loafers. As like a little quirky detail to the outfit, it makes it look a little preppy and dressy. I am wearing the same white t-shirt like in the last outfit, and I decided to layer it with this white short cardigan with like the big oversized buttons and i am wearing this camel coat and i am wearing this yankees black hat that i got recently i am gonna be honest i was heavily heavily inspired by zoe kravitz she has this black uh yankees hat similar to this and she rocks the crap out of it so i decided you know what if she can rock it i can rock it or try to <laughs> and and i am going to pair this outfit with this oversized scarf i got years ago don't remember where i got it from all right so this is the look for well, the base of the look I am wearing this sweatshirt that I recently thrifted. It says Indian Lakes on it. And I'm wearing these straight leg off-white jeans. I've been seeing a lot of people on Pinterest rocking. Uh, I have like a little fur, a little fiber in my lip, sorry. Seeing a lot of people pairing this with a lot of neutrals and I think it looks so cute for the winter time. So I am building the outfit based on these pants. I am gonna wear again my favorite boots right now as a layering piece i am going to add something that's not traditional which is a oversized blazer but we're still going to be warm because we have this sweatshirt and then we're going to add this hoodie balaclava that i got recently 
I'm just adding all these balaclavas. I bought like four of them, so you're gonna see them all in this uh, in this video. What makes this one different compared to the other ones that I showed is that it's kind of like a hoodie and it's like looser. So you can definitely wear it like this, just around your neck to kind of give the illusion that you're wearing like a pullover or like a hoodie. And then if you are cold, you can just at least, you could just put it like this. You tighten it if you're cold. And yeah, this is the outfit. So this is the final outfit. I am wearing this blue button down that I thrifted from the men's section with a white turtleneck underneath. And then I'm wearing these leggings with like a little slight flare to it that are plaid. And my favorite black ankle boots from ASOS. We are going to add a little texture and color to the outfit with this blue um, coat. And then we are going to add this scarf. I love this scarf so much. I got this from um, ASOS and they do look like the dupes of the Acme Studios. I don't know if it's still available, but if it is, I will link it down below or something similar to it. Um, so yeah, this will be the outfit. I love how this scarf adds a lot of color to the outfit. All right guys, so that's all the outfits I came up with for some inspiration for the winter time. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please comment down below if you have a favorite. Definitely everything's gonna be linked down below if it's still available online. So I'll see you next year and love you guys, bye.